Hello guys, today I'm going to show you how to install DLSS 3 mod for your GTA 5 game. So before we install the mod, you need to follow these steps. Open your GTA 5 game and go into the settings. Over there, we have to disable FXAA and MSAA. Make sure you disable it and then exit your game. Now we are going to install the DLSS mod. Here is the DLSS mod files, okay? These are the main files. Now open your file and application data. Go into the plugins and from here, select all three files and drag and drop this over here. After that, you need to delete the dxgi.dll file. It will be here on the plugins folder. So make sure you delete the dxgi.dll file. Then open NVIDIA console panel over here. Manage CD settings. Go on to the program settings. And make sure you select the gtfi.exe file. Select the file and go on to the bottom. Over there, vertical sync. Make sure you enable it. We have to enable the vertical sync. Okay, then apply it. So that's all folks. We are done with the installation. Now start 5M. So we are back here guys. Now you can check the FPS. I'm getting around 70 to 75. Okay, well this is a heavily modded server. So I'm getting up to 75. Or usually I can get around 90 to 100. Okay, now let's enable the DLSS. You need to press home button. As you can see, this is the menu for the DLSS mod. We have to enable. Make sure you check this box. Okay, and then go on to the DLSS frame generation. Now check. It has been doubled from 75 to 160, 170. See? It is working on 5M. Now again let me show you. We have disabled the DLSS frame generation mode. It's 75. Now I am going to enable it. 150, 160, 180. Now it's working guys. So that's how DLSS mod work for the 5M. So hope you guys enjoyed this video. I also made the DLSS mod installation for the single player too. Make sure you check that too also. So till then, peace out.